Hi, I'm Sir St. Felix, and today I'll show you how you can use Adobe Acrobat Sign to capture wet signatures. Now, Acrobat Sign is the perfect solution for capturing digital signatures, but every once in a while you may need to capture a wet signature. Acrobat Sign solves for this. So let's get into it on how you can do this. So first of all, I'm going to jump into Acrobat Sign. And to enable this feature, you'll need to be an admin and go to your account tab. So here I'm in the account tab. I'll scroll all the way down to Signature Preferences and then scroll all the way down to Additional Settings. The feature that you need checked is one that says Allow Signers to Print, Place Written Signatures, and Upload the Agreement back to Adobe Sign instead of e-signing it. Since I already have this feature checked, I'm ready to capture a wet signature. So from here, I'll click on my Send tab and then I'll just start a simple signing ceremony. So the first thing I'll do is I will capture my email address or I can just type in myself so that I can sign the document electronically. But then I'm going to add in another email address. In this case, if you want to download and hand deliver the document to the, uh, to the other recipient, you can put in an email address that you, you own. Or if you want to send that to the individual so they can download inside, then that's where you would add their email address. I'll change my message template to wet signatures. I'll go ahead and add a sales agreement for this demo. And then I'm going to click on preview and add signature fields. Now I've already created the reusable template for this particular signing ceremony, but I just want to show you what the agreement looks like and where the signatures will be placed. So here's our sales agreement. And then down below I have my signature fields for both signers. If you look on the bottom right, you'll see sign then send. So I'll go ahead and click on that so I can sign this electronically. Then it's going to go to an email address that I own where I can download it and sign it with a wet signature. So here's the agreement. I'll click on start. I'll go ahead and put in a fake company. And then we'll go ahead and sign. And I actually want to put my, e my actual name. So here's my name. Now I'll go ahead and click and sign. That's the signing process when you do it electronically as you're already familiar with. Next thing we'll do is we will capture this agreement in my email and we'll go ahead and download it. So here it is. I'll click on review and sign. And this is going to open up in a web browser. And this is going to give me the option to download the document, print it out, and then sign it. So here, if I were to click on Start, I could sign this electronically. But on the left-hand side, you're going to see these options. What you'll see is Print, Sign, and Upload. That's the option that I want. And so that's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to click on Next and then it's going to give me some steps to download. So I'll go ahead and click on download and I'll put in the individual's name that needs to sign it. Click download and now this is ready to download and it opens up in Adobe Acrobat which I have installed. And so all I need to do here is the signature for the first signer and this is where I'm going to add my signature with a wet signature. So I'll go ahead and hit print and now that's going to be printed. So here is the actual document and so we're going to go ahead and use just a traditional wet signature and I'm going to show you what this looks like. So here's the agreement and as you can see I have the fake company here is my signature with the date. So I'll go ahead and put in and we'll put this as the 1st of March and that's it. So here is the wet signature. It's ready to go. So the next thing I'll need to do is I'll actually need to scan this document and then upload it to Adobe Sign. So we're going to Go ahead and launch Adobe Scan and I want to scan 
both pages. So here's the first page that just scanned. And then I want to scan the second page. So I'll hit continue. And now it's going to scan the second page. All right. So I'll hit continue. And then there's the agreement. And so I'll go ahead and tile this wet signature. And we'll go ahead and put a date on this as well. Click rename. I'm going to save this as a PDF. And then I'm going to share this to my computer. So we'll go ahead and just airdrop this. And then we'll go ahead and open this up. And now we're done with that. And so now I'm actually going to open this We'll go ahead and go to my downloads folder. And I think it's way down here. Here we have it, wet signature. I'll click open. And then there's a sales agreement. Now, the scan is not as nice, but again, if we need to scan a document, here I've scanned it using Adobe Scan. I have my signatures. And now I'm ready to actually upload this agreement to complete the signing ceremony. So what we'll do now is I'll go ahead and click on upload to submit. So I'll click this button and this is a link that's also generated in your email. So if for some reason you happen to close out your browser, you can always go back to your email and grab the link to upload this signature. And so we'll go ahead and we'll go to my downloads folder. This is the wet signature that I just scanned. And now it's going to upload the document. Now the document is all set. I can actually download a copy uh, and view this document. Or we can go to the Manage uh, tab here in, Adobe, in Acrobat Sign. And I can take a look at the sales agreement. So if I were to open up this agreement, here it is. And there are the two signatures. I also have an audit trail. So if I want to click on download audit trail, we'll go ahead and open this up in Acrobat. And what you'll see is the blue seal that basically indicates that this document wasn't tampered with. And you can see the audit trail in terms of what exactly happened. Who created the document, who signed electronically, when the document was downloaded, and when it was uploaded. So this is how you can capture a wet signature using Adobe Acrobat Sign. I hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching.